How have you been? Yes, very good. Hope you are fine and safe. Today's value is respect your elders. You have to give respect to your elders. Children, now we will recap the parts of speeches. Now, verb, adjective, and pronoun once again. Children, there are eight parts of speech. How many parts of speech? There are eight parts of speech. So, in the previous class itself, we have already discussed about verb, noun, adjective, pronoun. So, we have already discussed about all these things. Today, we are going to learn about adverbs. Today, we are going to learn about adverbs. Before that, we will recap about verb, noun, adjective and pronoun. At first, we will recap about verb. Verbs are nothing. It describes an action or experience. It, it gives information about what the person is doing or what the animal is doing or what the thing is doing. So, it gives or it describes an action or experience. For example, run, walk push etc these are the examples for verb verbs are nothing it tells something about it tells what the person is doing or what the animal is doing or what the thing is doing so it, it describes an action verbs are also called as action the next one is noun nouns are nothing it is a name of a person place things or ideas or an animals you can say it as our animals so it gives names for a person place thing or an animal for example house teacher cup shop these are the examples for a noun next topic is adjective Adjectives are nothing. It describes a noun or a pronoun. So, it gives information about a noun or a pronoun. See the examples. Short, beautiful, red, old. These are the examples. It gives more information. Adjectives are nothing. It gives more information about a noun or a pronoun. Next topic is pronoun. It replaces the name of a person, place, thing or idea is in a sentence. So, it replaces pronouns, replace the name of a person, place, thing or idea in a sentence. It means it replaces the word of a person, place, thing or an animal. You can say it as an idea. So, pronouns are I, V, U, they, he, she, it. These are called as pronouns. Did you all understood the parts of speakers children? Yes. Today we are going to learn adverbs. What we are going to learn adverbs. So, in the previous class itself we have already learned what are called as verbs. The that action words are called as verbs. So, today we are going to learn Adverbs. Repeat after me, children. Adverbs. Okay. So now we'll see the definition for adverbs. And adverb is a word that tells something more about a verb or an adjective. So adverbs are nothing. It tells or it gives more information about a verb. Or an adjective. It describes more about a verb 
Worksheet. 